Now, when it comes to doing live studio production, one of the amazing features that comes into play is mixing and layering. Now, being able to do this in post is one thing, but being able to do this in a live stream or live editing situation is a whole other. On the right-hand side of your screen, you'll find the media mixing tabs and panels. With the first tab, media, you'll be able to easily add control and adjust things like image files, which allow you to screen share or show something in the bottom corner of your image. You can also add text layers image layers, movies, things like lower thirds or things that enhance your output. On the top right hand side, you'll be able to control each and every camera and do things like exposure bias or zooming in and out. You're also able to go directly into the iPhone on the capture app and actually change any of those settings as well. Cinemaker allows you to have a dedicated audio input, which can be separate device that uses the Cinemaker Capture app, but under the audio option. And so many other features, including things like chroma key or AKA green screening, there is a huge opportunity to make something fantastic out of each and every one of your live streams. At the end of the day, the sky's the limit when it comes to mixing and layering. So get creative and uh, start producing.